This is the Gadwall Magnum. This is the updated version of our older uh, Gadwall call, which we still sell. It's shorter and louder. It's great for them cypress brakes with the green seat on top of it that them Gadwalls love so much. Or you can give this call to a beginning caller and uh, or your kids and they can be part of the game with you because they're not going to scare anything off with it. That is a Gadwall. Gadwall Magnum. Alright, a new call out for this year, the Pioneer. We're super fired up about this call. It's built off of our Jace Pro Series Reed system. As you can see, it's dipped in Realtree Original. So we decided to call it the Pioneer because you've got the Pioneer of Double Reed Duck Call Makers teaming up with the Pioneer of Camouflage Makers. This call will do everything you need it to do. It's more of a mid-range call, so you know once the ducks get in there kind of tight, it'll do all of that. It'll scream a little, but it's really designed for that mid-range to finishing end of things. It sounds something like this. <laughs> Pioneer, it's a must have for you. This call is awesome. Last year we came out with the Jace Robertson Pro Series and we had an acrylic. And based on your feedback to us, we now have three different styles in acrylic. One of them has a ring with the Real Tree Max 5, which is really cool. And then we have the wooden version, we have a maple, a black wood, and a tiger wood. The difference in the wood and the acrylic is pretty much common knowledge, but I'll demonstrate it for you. The wooden call is going to be a little softer. And a little smoother. And your acrylics, they're going to have a little more and they're gonna be a little more scratchy. So you got one to get their attention, and as they grow closer, you milk it down with the wooden version of that. This is the triple threat. And by triple thread, it has three reeds instead of two. Me and my buddy from Washington, Steve Schultz, developed this call over the span of about a year. And what we were trying to do is create three reeds that are easy to blow, because the more reeds you have, the more difficult it is to get the reeds to harmonize. We figured it out, and the result was a unique sound. The triple threat is real gravelly on the low end. Like an old mature hen. But when you do the greeting call or the hail call, it kind of sounds like a younger hen with a little scratchiness in there. And this call is tough. I mean, it is very durable spit, rain, weather conditions. I like it because you can do a lot of things with it. You can manipulate your air, you can get higher pitches, you can get lower pitches. So it's a great call for beginners because it doesn't take a lot of air to use and it gives you a lot of options when conditions change. Tail call, tail hen. This is the call that the tail hen makes. A little faster cadence and higher pitch than a mallard hen. Tail hen. <laughs>